able to buy any of them. Um, can't buy any of them. So let's just get started with the normal lantern. As you can see, the lantern pretty bold, I guess. It's good for starters. And then, after the lantern, is actually animated. I really like this one and it illuminates a lot of like I highly suggest this one if you want to use this one. And then we have the Nightmare 3 Lantern. This one doesn't do a lot of light but it used to heal. I remember when I got this I think it healed. However, however I was in time I feel like I feel like if this did heal though, this would be super OP. I, 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 I mean, I'm not confused why they like removed it, like, if they didn't remove it, it would be like way too OP and obviously the death would be funny. Then, next up, we have Nightmare 2 Lantern. Nightmare 2 Lantern, pretty, it, it's basically an upgrade from the first Lantern. It has a nice white color and it has a little butterfly spirit inside. Honestly, this lantern is one of my favorites because it just it fits well. And then we have this one, which is the Futea Bote Lantern. The Futea Bote Lantern was obtained by completing Witch Trials in Lantern Mode. And it has Futea's Mote, Futea, Futea in Mote's face on each side. Um, this is Futeo, this is Monte, if you were wondering. And we have these lanterns, I've already showcased these. Oops. And we have this, these lanterns, which these are super cool dragon lantern lanterns from the Halloween event. This one is basically just the last one, except it's actually shaped like a pumpkin. Pretty, pretty snazzy. Jigoku's Lantern. I showcased this to you already. But basically, it's actually, the eyes were animated. And it's super, it, it's super creepy. However, the cool thing about the Jigoku Lantern is that the Jigoku Lantern is, uh, was actually obtained by like a secret Halloween event. Um, and the Halloween event was actually released on October 6th, I think. I got it on October 3rd because on October 1st I was busy with some stuff. And then, my favorite one, we have Hayachi's Lantern. Hayachi's Lantern is actually the newer one. Uh, I think it was released one or two weeks ago. Basically, Hayachi's Lantern kind of looks like he's pretending to cry, but basically, you do it similarly to the Jigoku Lantern, except instead of just doing Jigoku, you have to talk to Hayachi and get it from there. You have to t talk to Hayachi, and then there's an, an extra 13 souls that you have to get. And then you have to select Hayachi's necklace and bring it back to Hayachi. Anyways, that's it for this video. Um, there aren't any more lanterns, I don't think. That's why there's the VIP and the two type lantern. But, I am very poor. Yes, I admit it, I am poor. So, I don't have those yet but those might be in a later video